on, everybody? Welcome to episode 60 of our Watford career mode, and today, three pretty big games. We've got Norwich in the league, and then we've got Chelsea in the first leg of our round of 16 tie in the Europa League, and then we have a quarter final in the FA Cup against Wolves. So, a lot of games, a lot of big games coming. We can take a look at the league, and here we sit. Down in sixth, one point back of Tottenham, four back of Chelsea, though we have a game in hand on Chelsea. And, I mean, our last two results have been very, very poor indeed. So we're going to have to play a little bit better. We're going to have to <laughs> be up and ready to go. Hopefully, you know, we can go ahead and uh, pull something out. Regelon is suspended for today, so we are going to get Dest in at left back. But it looks like everyone else should be ready to go. The problem being is that we have that game against Chelsea, which is ultra important. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to switch a couple players out. We're going to get that Moisey Keane. Ooh, maybe not. Mm. Let's see. Barnes can definitely start. Kent can start. Um... I would nope. I don't need to start. I'm thinking more about striker. I'm gonna start Troy Deeney up front, actually, and then Moisey Keane can come off the bench. Jonathan David Benitez can start here at defensive midfielder. Fernandez can start. Militao and can sit out. And Ajer can play. Gonna bring By onto the bench. We're gonna have a lot of changes here. We'll take McKenney out, and we'll probably go with this team. So Dini, Graylish, Barnes, Kent, and then Benitez, Fernandez, Heinrich, Auger, Gomez, Dest, and Rui in net. So let's jump into this. bit rotated, but hopefully we can still grab something here. So holding on to it nicely gets it forward. So well done. Here's Graylish. One more. Can we get it out wide? We can. Here's Barnes. And Barnes racing into the box. And he's a penalty. Surely it is. He's missed time. That's so poorly. The Norwich man. And he's going to get a booking as well. Sam Byram. In place of what I assume is Max Ahrens. Because we've got Max Ahrens. Ball set to come in. It's Troy Deeney to take the penalty. You get it low and away. He hits it right and it's... Oh my god. It's hit the post. And stayed out. <laughs> and he's caught that and not hit him in the back magically. Come on. Oh, a massive opportunity goes wasting. Oh my god. That's a good play forward. He is on side. I thought I wasn't going to catch him offside. He's hit the outside of the post and we escape. That is all on me. <laughs> I thought I'd play him on side and then the right back stepped back just a touch and played him on. And we were behind him and he smashed the outside of the post and we get to have time nil nil. Not great. And it's been a theme in the Premier League lately. And we, I mean, we got to win. It's a good turn, and Kana is going to hold on to it. A little bit lucky there, and he's come to Graylish. And Graylish is in on goal. It's a great save. It's Kana who goes. Oh, it's just wide. That's a massive opportunity. Probably our best, though the penalty is a pretty good opportunity, of course. But from open play, that's probably our best chance. And it's a big one, but we cannot find the back of the net. Graylish playing a little bit deeper now. Here's Fernandez, plays it forward to Keane, and Keane plays it on. And here's Kana, and Kana cuts back. Kana goes for goal, and he's forced a good save here. We've made a couple of changes, and they're starting to really have an effect on the game. We're getting much, much closer. It's Harvey Barnes here. Can he play it out wide? He can. Here's Kent, and Kent can get it back. He can. Graylish! Oh, it's just wide. Oh, God. We're getting really, really close here. The goal is coming. You can feel it, but there's not a ton of time left. More. Nicely done. And there's plenty of space out here. We play that ball through. We can, and Kent has it. And Kent is holding off challenges. And Kent can cut back out. He's still on it. Kent, brilliant from Kent. Oh, what a save. And that's going to land on top of the net. That's really well done from Kent. He's using his strength to hold that off. Very nicely done. Graylish hooks that in. and Oh, I thought that found him for a moment. It doesn't. Ten minutes to go. We need the lead. Nicely done. Can we play the... Oh, come on. You've got to play that through. He's in on goal here. That's a great save 
from Rui. It really is. That ball's got to get through. A minute and a half to go. Can anyone find the winner? Barco's going to collect it, and he's just on and fresh. And he is racing up this wing. Can we do something here? Here comes Barco. His pace causing huge problems already. And he's muscled off it. Oh, come on. Damn, that is so annoying. We're going to drop points again. Three games in a row that have been draws against teams we should be beating. West Ham, Aston Villa, and Norwich. The season in the league is fading away. and ugh, It's a four-point gap between us and Chelsea. And then assuming Spurs win, it's a four-point gap to them as well. we got to play both of those teams, but even then, not good. Not good at all. Oh, man. It's annoying. I tried to bring Barco on earlier. You saw the impact he was looking to make already. We just couldn't get him on. But here we are. Chelsea, the team that might kill our season in the Europa League and the, reg and the regular league, <laughs> the Premier League. Um, we got leg number one. We're at home. We need a result here, a win, preferably. And a win in a clean sheet would actually be great. But... We'll see. So we're going to play Jonathan David to start. Um, and at left back, Regilon is fit and ready to go. Um, right back, Max Aarons can play. And do I want to play Gomez? Yeah, Gomez is good to go. So let's jump into it. A big game here. Watford, Chelsea. Let's go. That's a poor ball. Let's come to Hernandez. And Jonathan David rushing forward here. Can he slip that into Hernandez? He can. And Hernandez, it's a great block. It's come back to him. And, oh, it's just wide. You ought to be finishing that, Hernandez. He gets a second bite of it. Cannot finish it up, though. Nicely done. One more. Can we do something before halftime? It's been open, but not chances open. Open in the fact that play is kind of going end to end as Hernandez cuts back inside nicely Hernandez brilliantly done always oh, hit the post the amount of times we've hit the post in the last two episodes what is that seven now oh and it's gonna go out of play and we're gonna get to halftime it's nil nil it's been decent it's been tough to deal with but this game is very very open and you feel a goal pop through at some point hopefully it's ours though can we win that here on the edge? Done well to turn back inside. That's a poor giveaway we've forced. And here's Decore. Can he get this forward? He can. Jonathan David's in on goal. He's always hit the post. Stop. Stop, stop, stop. There is no way that we're hitting the post this much. What is happening? And Regilon's coming forward. Finds Jonathan David, and it's a good ball forward today. Lefeu. Who Dumfries is chasing, but he's not going to collect. And we see the run back post. Sar! Oh, what a save! Oh, he did the right thing. He headed down, but... Kepa, I believe that is in goal, has made an unbelievable save there. Emre Chan. Can he find that ball into Hernandez? He can, and Hernandez still holding on to it. Decore. De La Fe. You can play it forward here. Jonathan David. We're just looking... For a route through to goal. It's Emre Chan. He gets it out. Decore's in a good spot. Now he's hit the post. There's something wrong. There has to be something wrong that we've hit the post this many times. There has to be something wrong, man. There has to be. What is going on? It's clipped into a good space. He does win the header there. Gets it back out wide, but... We do manage to take it away nicely. One more. There it is. Decore. Back across. Here's Emre Chan. And Emre Chan's racing into space. And we've got a couple men forward here. If they would just make runs. Jonathan David. That took way too long. We had plenty of men here. As that ball gets blasted away. It's going to come back to Jonathan David. And out to De La Feu, Who turns inside. Gets it across. What a ball back post. I've hit the post. I've hit the post. Again. There is no way. <laughs> I don't know if that got saved onto the post to be fair. But we've... Uh, What's going on? We're into added time here, and this game looks like it's going to finish nil-nil, unless we 
someone can get another opportunity. We might have it here. But the amount of times we've hit the post, there's got to be something wrong, right? I'm not the only one who's insane here. As that gets put through to Kent, does well to get to the byline there. Here's Hernandez. Can we steal a win here? That would be awesome. It's Kent. And Kent, that's poor. It's just a poor pass. But nil-nil, it's not the worst result in the world because we only have to go to Chelsea and get a point now. But what is going on with the post? Is there something wrong? Am I losing my mind here? We've hit the post there four or five times. And we hit the post five times last episode. We've hit the post like four or five or six times today. I have no idea what's going on. Schalke get a really good win. Frankfurt get a really good win. And Villarreal are level after their first leg. I cannot believe how that game's gone. I really cannot believe how that game's gone. Unbelievable. We're going to jump into the Wolves game. The amount of draws we've had lately is not great. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. The jerseys are going to have to change. We're going to play in the blue. And they can play in orange. I press play match on accident there. There are players who aren't fit. It's just been one of those days. We're going to jump into it. Hopefully they can get to have time, some of them. And then after that, we'll see. But FA Cup. Wolves, Watford. <laughs> Let's go. One more. Decore. Can we slip it through to Hernandez? We can! He's finished it! And finally, something has gone in and not off the post. After a whopping zero goals in our first two games from any team, we have finally put <laughs> the ball in the back of the net. It's 1-0. It's a great finish. And a really good ball into him. But this finish is really nice as well. Hernandez makes a really good run. And Decore draws that defender over to make space for him. And he has provided a brilliant finish. Look at that. The technique on that is really nice. Patricio gets a touch to it, but cannot keep it out. And it's 1-0. Back across. Nicely done. Can we play it inside? We can. That's a foul. In a dangerous spot. And it's a red. It is a red card for Bennett. He's out of here. That's a big, big call. I guess technically he would have been through if he would have kept on running after the slide, but a big, big call that can definitely help us. Hernandez to take the free kick. Can we double whammy? Oh, it's a brilliant save. Almost. But we have a goal advantage and a man advantage now for the last 70 minutes. As Graylish goes for goal, and that's just past the post. Lovely stuff. De La Feu. He's going to get onto it, back into space. Hernandez, can he get played through? He can. And Hernandez does well. Slides it across. Graylish took forever to take that shot. It's hit the post and stuff, and it's finally gone in. That hit the post on the way in, too, my dad. But that was very strange. I'm glad it went in eventually because it deserved to go in. But Graylish just felt like not hitting it. He let it roll across him. Look at that. And then he finally hits it. It just smashes the post a bunch of times in between the defender and the post, and then Graylish just gets in there and sticks a foot in while that guy isn't clearing it. The strangest of goals. But we've hit the post on the way in this time. And we're 2-0 up here and in a brilliant position to get into the next round. Coming forward now. Plays it through is Chan. And he could play it through to Hernandez, and Hernandez slips it back to Chan, and he's blared it over. Oh, what a chance to end the half there. And Emre Chan is just... Oh my god, he has smashed it out of the stadium. And we are going to get to halftime, but it looks like perhaps it'll be a two-goal lead. We're going to try and change that as that ball gets played in through as De La Feu, And he goes for goal. That's a great block. De La Feu's on it again, but it's eventually cleared. And that should be that. Nicely done. It's good football here. It's Barco on it now. And Barco is in a bit of space, does well, gets it back to Decore. Oh, what a block. It's come back to Decore. Oh, no, it's a great save the second time. A massive opportunity there. We're the ones closest to another goal here. Though they do represent a threat still, Wolves. But we're getting very close, and it feels like a third goal is coming as Emery Chan goes close as well. Corner gets lifted in. It's headed down, but it's come back Ooh, to Militao. Gets it out to Graylish. 
Graylish turns nicely. Can he get it across? He can. Barco Chen! Oh, it's a great save. I thought that still found the back of the net. Not quite. Finds Moisey Keen. One more to Graylish. And Graylish does well to get around. And here comes Graylish. Doing well. It's blocked onto him. Decore. One more. Emre Chen! 3 0, and that should be game over. It's been coming, and it has finally arrived. It's 3 0. 20 minutes to go, and we should be into the semifinal of the FA Cup. We are flying at the moment here. After a very hard first couple of games, we are finally getting our goal scoring touch back. We're not hitting the post as much. And it's 3 0. Barco. Barco racing forward. There's plenty of men here. And can we get that through? Brilliant ball from Barco, 4 0. That's a great ball from Barco. And I'm so glad Graylish kept that run up because a lot of times they don't keep that run up. But Graylish has done it there. Barco has found him with an inch perfect ball. And then first time Graylish smashes it past Patricio right into the back of the net. It's 4 0. And we've been dominant here. A minute to go here at Vicarage Road. And we are going to head into the semifinal of the FA Cup, which is very, very nice. We'd love a tournament win, of course. And you know what? We were looking at it earlier. Chelsea, Arsenal, the two other best teams in it, and they're playing each other. So a semifinal here. We're going to have a, you know, a two-thirds chance at getting a team that we should be beating. Um, or we could, of course, get Chelsea. <laughs> if Chelsea were to knock us out of fourth and the Europa League, and the semi-final of the final of the FA Cup. I would have a genuine deep hatred for them. More than I already do. And after they're sending off, Wolves had nothing. As Arsenal knocked Chelsea out. So there goes that. Preston and Fulham will play. Another one will go to the semi-final along with West Ham. So West Ham, Arsenal, Watford, Fulham in the final four. That's winnable. That is a very, very, very winnable um, tournament there. A very winnable one. So let's go forward a minute. Let's take a look at our inbox items before we take a look at what's going to happen next episode. But as you can see, it's pretty straightforward. Chelsea right there. We only need a form draw to really, or a, a score draw to go ahead and do something there. Um, squad rotation is important. I expect more of you. What are we looking at here? Match rescheduled. Pressure and suspension over. So, next episode, let's take a look. Standings. Of course, the second leg of our Europa League tie. Where are we going? We also have to check how, we, how we're doing in the Premier League after that draw. Because that hasn't popped up yet. I've been taking a look. Premier League. We're in six still. We're only three points back. Did they both lose? Oh, uh, well, they didn't, but Chelsea? Oh, no, they had their game in hand. So, no. So, we're three points back of Tottenham and Chelsea. Let's see what those two schedules look like. Tottenham play City next, and Chelsea play Wolves. Those are tough. And then we play City. Ugh. Chelsea are away to Brighton. Tottenham away to Wolves. Tough. Chelsea play Leicester. Tottenham play us. So, um, Tottenham play Everton. I don't know. And then Chelsea, Manchester City. So, it's... You know, there's some area there to make up ground, but we're going to have to win our game. So next episode, Chelsea, Burnley, and Manchester City. Very, very, very tough, very important. It's going to be a heck of an episode, guys. But I hope you have enjoyed this. Of course, stay tuned for more. And peace.